I never really wanted this chair. I guess some part of me knew it would happen, but I always dreaded the weight of it, the responsibility. The truth is, I can barely make the right choices for myself. I love you. I've been trying to take this club in a direction I thought made sense to move us away from all the outlaw shit. That hasn't worked. You don't ever sit on another man's bike, asshole. Some part of me was trying to buy back all the bad shit I've done. The people I've hurt. That's a false pardon. It's dangerous, and it's selfish. JT did the same thing. I love you, Dad. And those choices took away everything from my old man. His family and his patch. Obi was right. You can't sit in this chair without being a savage. I already lost the woman I love. I'm not gonna lose my club. For me to move forward is all the things we now have to do. I need to know this table has no dogs. No mistrust. That every single one of you I call it. would kill. <laughs> Or die with the man next to him. And if you don't feel that way, now's the time to speak up. We're all in, brother. We love you. We trust you. Tell us what you need.